Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Nick from Noobkill coming at you with another Madden video today. And today I'll be talking about the ESPN SVP and realistic low Madden Ultimate Team vote. I made a video about this before. If you haven't seen that, go ahead and check it out. I'll leave a link in the description as well. But yeah, in that video, I did talk about ESPN. So I'm Canadian. So in Canada, we do not get um, ESPN broadcast. We actually get something called TSN. Um, but actually ESPN actually owns TSN so it's basically the same thing but we, sometimes we get the ESPN broadcast but um, sometimes we don't and we also have different commentators um, on the show on TSN so I've never heard of SVP or Realistolo in my life and I watch a good amount of TSN um, but yeah so I posted that video and a lot of you guys actually said that you guys watch ESPN and you never heard of these guys as, all, as well but then someone else commented said these two guys are actually from the ESPN radio broadcast. So that's possibly why you guys never heard of them if you have watched ESPN. But yeah, if you have logged in Madden Mobile since um, March 2nd, you would have got at least one message about this event and you would get one collectible card. And I'll talk about that collectible card just near the end of the video. Okay, so let me read everything out. Um, so ESPN SVP and Ryan Rilisolo joined the fight with three NFL players in the Madden Ultimate Team vote. Who created the best team and will take all the glory? Um, each coach chooses 11 offensive stars, a punter and a kicker, and one defensive team to be the superstar of their Madden Ultimate Team rosters. And the fans, so us, have the opportunity to vote for their favorite coach and his team. So here are the two... I guess the two ESPN guys are, and I guess, yes, it does say stay tuned for SVP and release those um, ESPN radio. So I guess the radio broadcasters, I'm guessing SVP is on the left just because that's how they ordered the name. But I don't know if they're, I don't know. Uh, and here are the other three NFL players they did meant or they talked about. Um, Demarius Thomas, um, Jer Jeremy Macklin, and rob gronkowski so those are the th five coaches and let's go ahead and read the team so i do apologize apologize if i say any of these guys names wrong but first off we got rob gronkowski um quarterback obviously you got tom brady halfback running back we got um bo jackson fullback franco harris wide receiver larry fitzgerald and chris carter Tight end, which is actually pretty funny, he put himself, so Rob Gronkowski is tight end. Offensive line, Nick Mangold, uh, Logan Mankins, Marshall Yanda, Jake Long, and Sebastian Vollmer. Um, and then his punter is Ryan Allen, and kicker is Steven Goskowski. Uh, defense is the Baltimore Ravens. So his team is actually has a lot of Patriots players. But yeah, so let's move on to the next player. Jeremy Macklin, Philadelphia Eagles, wide receiver. Quarterback, Dan Marino. Halfback, running back, Marshall Falk. Fullback, Franco Harris. Wide receivers are Calvin Johnson and Isaac Bruce. Tight end is Sa uh, Shannon Sharp. My bad. Um, offensive line, Ryan Khalil. Um, Gene Upshaw, David DeCastro, Jason Peters, Dan Deerdorf, And those are his offensive line. Punter is Andy Lee. Kicker is uh, George Blanda. And defense is Seattle Seahawks. Talking about the Philadelphia Eagles, can you guys believe that trade that happened yesterday? Uh, LaShawn McCoy for um, Kiko Alonso. So Shady McCoy went to Buffalo and now Kiko Alonso is now on Philadelphia Eagles. So looking at that now, the Bills, Buffalo Bills actually look so nice now. All they need is a good quarterback and hopefully they can get something in the draft or maybe trade later on because Kyle Orton, he's great. He's a good quarterback and everything, but that young team could get a better quarterback. So, And now they got Rex Ryan. We'll see how that will work out. But yeah, enough of that talk. Let's go back on this ESPN voting thing. Next, we got Rulisolo's team. Quarterback, Andrew Luck. Halfback, running back, Marshawn Lynch. Fullback is John Kuhn. Wide receiver, he has Des Bryant and Jordy Nelson. Tight end, he actually put one of the other coaches, Rob Gronkowski. Offensive line, he got Jason Kelsey. Um... Zach Martin, David DeCastro, Joe Thomas, um, Tyrone Smith is his last one. And then finally, punter, he got Johnny Hecker and kickers Adam Vinatieri. And his defense, he picked Cleveland Brown. All right, now moving on to Demarius Thomas. We Denver Broncos wide receiver. Uh, quarterback, you got Steve Young. Halfback, running back, Barry Sanders. Fullback, Stanley uh, Havardi. Or <laughs> Havardi. Uh, Heavily. Havley. I'm sorry if I pronounced that name wrong. I think it's Havley. Um, wide receiver, Antonio Brown, AJ Green, 
um, as his other wide receiver and his tight end Shannon Sharp. Offensive line Dominic Riolu, Mike uh, Lupati, uh, Lupati, Lupati, I think. Yeah, Lupati, that's his name. Uh, Marshall Yanda, Jason Peters, and M um, Michael Schwartz. And then finally, punter is Pat McAfee. Kicker is Justin Tucker, and his defense is New England Patriots. So that's a Denver Broncos fan picking the England New England Patriots defense. So that's great to see. I'm a Patriots fan, so that's great. We see our defense up there. And finally, the last ESPN radio and the last coach, SVP quarterback, Aaron Rodgers, halfback, running back, Walter Payton, fullback, John Kuhn, and this shocked me, actually, wide receiver. This is the first time on these guys' list Jerry Rice showed up. So that kind of shocked me that he's only on one guy's team. So yeah, Jerry Rice is there. Julio Jones is the other wide receiver. Tight end, Jimmy Graham. Offensive line, Nick Mangold. Gene Upshaw, Marshall Yanda. Anthony Munzu. And Tyrone Smith. Punter, Pat McAfee again. Kicker, Steven Goskowski. And then his defense, he picks San Francisco 49ers. So the 49ers got their defense on this list as well. <clears throat> sorry about that let's go ahead and move on to what it says here all right so how to vote for your favorite team play uh players will receive a vote collectible item that can be added to one of the five different set that cost uh that cast their votes for their favorite team so if you guys watched that video i voted for rob gronkowski um you also if you any doesn't matter which one you vote for, you will get an additional 100 coins just for voting. I know people were saying in that video, uh, vote for Jeremy Macklin, you get a 1,000 coins. But I think people were just trying to troll and try to make you um, vote for Macklin. But I think you only get 100 coins for any of them. And then players will receive one uh, vote collectible card upon first login. So if you have logged in during March 2nd, um, you would get this login voting card. Also... They will have the opportunity to play one or two solo challenges sequences in um, Mutt, Madden Ultimate Team, to get an, another vote collectible. So, sooner or later, we're going to get some live events in Madden Mobile. Um, <clears throat> sorry about that again. Um, to get another voting collectible. So, that's actually really, really sweet that we get, get another chance to vote. Um, but, yeah. A bonus for the winning team during the week of March 9. So I'm guessing this ends March 9. Um, all Madden um, mobile players, Madden ultimate team players um, who logged in will receive a bonus player chosen from the team who won the ESPN Madden ultimate team vote. So basically, I don't know if you have to choose the right one. I'm guessing you don't from how vague this uh, last sentence is. Last sentence, sorry. So basically, if... Let's say Jeremy Macklin wins. Um, one of these players will get a card. I don't know. Let's read that last sentence again. Um, we'll receive a bonus player chosen from the team that won the ESPN. I don't know if you get to choose who you get to pick or they randomly just give it to you. So let's say, again, uh, Macklin, let's say if he won, you could probably get one of these one of these 11 guys on offense and the two punters or kickers. So Calvin Johnson, Shannon Sharp, any of those guys, if he wins. <clears throat> Sorry, guys, for the coughing near the end. I'm, I'm, I think I'm getting sick and this talking for very long. But yeah, um, you get, I think you just randomly get a player. So that's actually so sick that they give you some new content. But that's more of a breakdown about this ESPN voting thing. If you watch my Twitch recap, I forgot to mention they did talk about this. So they, this is basically what they said, kind of, just more summed up. Um, they didn't tell us the players, but they told us um, you get to vote for the teams. And actually, the NFL players are actually into this. They've been tweeting about it. I believe they said that. I didn't really check their tweets, but um, on the live stream, they did say that. Um, I, I can't remember who they said tweeted it, but they were like ready, down for this ESPN voting. And they can't wait till it's finished to see who won. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is the ESPN SVP Realistic Low Madden Ultimate Team Vote um, content breakdown. More in depth for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please hit that subscribe button. Leave a like on this video and share with all your friends. And I'll catch you guys soon. Peace.